Hey everybody, my name is Phil. I'm Erica. And today we're watching Succession, Season 1, Episode 8. Let's dive in. You're at 5.3? Uh, correct. And I think we can live with that? Yeah? Yeah. Uh, it's a good price. What the f is going on? He's selling me things I want at a fair price? Hmm. So what's next? Fellatio? I think he just wants out fast. If he does, Why, though? We f him. Yeah. I think we did just f him. Walk him to the elevator and tell him 4 9. Oh, Dad, no, that's. it's insulting. Walk him to the elevator and tell him 4 9. Jerry, you do it. You f off. Oof. If you can't do it, f off. All right. Just text on your phone, you bendy f <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> Greg. Is he not doing it? Oh, oh dude. Like, so insulting, oh, it's oh, funny. Yeah. Oh, he's gonna do it. Are you okay? Dude, I don't suppose you know a coke dealer in Prague, do you? Uh, probably. Yeah, why? Uh, Tom Wan's bachelor party. And if he doesn't well, show me, he's a fuck. I don't, you know, I'm sorry for this shit. Hey. Yeah. Let me tell you something, dude. Fuck Prague. <laughs> My girlfriend and her fucking freak dogs run these. You ever heard of these parties? Romboid? I have a reputation. I can't take my crew to watch some art pricks dance around in fucking bowler hats and twizzle their mustaches <laughs> out of time to the beats. Are you done? You know who else will be there? Sandy Furness. He goes to that kind of thing? I know, right? <laughs> but he is sitting on the other half of your dad's dream deal. Hmm. Packet of 50 more local stations. Oh, Come to the party. Get him to sell. And trust me when I say this, you will become the number one son. Yeah, Sandy more? goes. She yeah. goes, get me those names and uh, I'll get you on that list. Yeah. And one more thing, bring hmm. Kendall, okay? I need to patch things up with him. <laughs> They're doing their own thing now? <laughs> I don't know. Well, thanks. What's uh, the plan here? said that they're vc -ing. What do I mean? Like venture capitalists uh, investing in companies. It's like where startups get money from. <clears throat> Frank, Kendall, <laughs> this is dust. Hey man, <laughs> Super startup-y. Love the name, by the way. Very <laughs> funky. <laughs> uh, sorry, please excuse Captain fucking Beep Up here. How's it going? How's it going? Cool earrings, very uh, Bauhaus. Big fan of what you guys do. Fucking sweet chili sauce. Too much. Thanks. Uh, likewise. Basically, uh, you buy a painting from uh, some art student in a basement, jack up the price, sell it to some Morgan Stanley sex pest, and you, me, and the student all get rich, right? We're interested in increasing the reach of young artists. And the democratization of art. No, absolutely. Democratization is used by like uh, every single uh, really? startup. It's like their mission. The, the next generation of artists. I'm just telling you how it works from the outside to the sharks. So I... I, I, I I got these sneakers on the way down here because uh, I thought, I don't know what I thought, I thought you'd all be dressed like fucking Bjork and uh, I wanted to uh, make an impression. The truth is, I, I don't know anything about art. What I do know is how to monetize your concept and achieve the scale it deserves. Don't sell your soul to some monolith. We're boutique, we're light on our feet, we're not the gang of four, we're the fucking rebel alliance. So... It's a bit more real. Mm -hmm. What? Talk to me. Talk to me. What do I need to do? Do I, do I need to take off my dopey sneakers? No. Yeah, I will. I, seriously, I'll throw them out the fucking window right now. <laughs> don't, don't. I'm, They're not bad. I'm, I'm taking them off. <laughs> I'm taking them off. No, 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 Here, come on, have them. Trade you. Woo! <laughs> Trade you. Okay? Can we talk now? Okay, that was a good save. What is your job? I know. <laughs> Where's Tom? Um, so, what do you think, Miss? Uh, between, you know. Sorry, I'm. I'm or he's waiting you know, for. I'm somewhat between the the devil and the deep blue sea here because mm -hmm. my you know my boss downstairs is <laughs> waiting and my boss upstairs is him. Uh, it's uh, it's the wheel. It's uh. <laughs> it's, 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 it. It. That's why. Oh, it's buffering. Uh, you could try knocking it down to low, low quality. Mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> yeah, just 
So I hear you and the boys are uh, heading out for Tom's bachelor party. Yes, that's correct. Uh, Roman's arranging. Prague has been mentioned. Do me a favor. Can you make sure that candle doesn't come back in a box? Mm. Okay. Yeah, I, no, I don't want him showing up dead at the bottom of some French pool. Oh, no, absolutely. None of us, none of us do. Keep an eye on him for me. Mm. Is this something you can do for me? Mm -hmm. Interesting. I hear he's been um, wetting his beak. Would now be a convenient time to talk with you uh, about a, like a lateral shift in terms of my position at the company? Mm, good for him. Because I'd like to move on from Parks. I don't want to mention any names because I... But the culture there, it, it borders on the personally abusive at times. <laughs> Tom. Oh, Tom. <laughs> I didn't know he had it in him. He can be pretty able in that department. Mm -hmm. um, but what I'm doing, sir, is I'm flagging to you. <laughs> respect that I'm thirsty mm -hmm. for the next chapter. Well, you take care of this for me, and perhaps we'll talk. Hmm. Okay? Done? <laughs> Keep him yeah. alive. Much yeah. <laughs> is a cancer well, at the heart of America. Can't believe I'm getting paid to call my dad names. It's so cathartic. <laughs> <laughs> you really think you should do ATM? Yeah, sure. Into the lion's den. I guess, yeah. He'll attack them. Righteous, Old Testament, anti-capitalist gill. They all attack us. There's a red in the bed. They get the viewers and we get the base fired up. No one's mind's getting changed. And then once we're through the primaries, we pivot to center. Except Gil won't pivot. I say no! I'll get him to pivot. I've got a feeling it's liable to get a little disgusting. Tom, Tom, I don't think you're supposed to be telling me this. No, no, I just, <laughs> I know. Just wanted to flag it and, you know, calm the qualms. Enjoy yourself, okay? Oh, Shiv, it's a honey badger. God, I want to duck myself inside you right oh so God. much right now. Yeah. <laughs> I love you too, Tom. <laughs> oh, that's not a turn on. They're all going to fit in there? Oh. Uh. On Coke. Hey, hope not. What up? So, <laughs> great thing I hope not. Fuck a hobo. What? Hmm. Wait, no, we're going to a party in the tunnel. Okay, no, relax. We're not going to a party in a tunnel. This is just a ruse. Well, what is this? Some pop-up shit? Am I gonna need my Central Europe coat? <clears throat> Tell me what now. I'm wearing Central uh, Europe coat. Socks and my TSA <clears throat> I know Come what on. you're doing right now. Okay. Oh shit, um, <laughs> fellas. Sorry, it's actually a really tight guest list. So. Oh, Roman. Yeah. Matt, it's Matt and Jonas. Oh. The fly guys aren't on the... They flew in. I Roman. Know, just relax. What? We're going to figure it out. In. We're going to first wave it. We'll call you once we're inside. All right? Oh, man. Roman, what yeah. the fuck have you got planned for me, man? No. <laughs> <laughs> no, seriously. What have you got planned? Tom, frog fell through, and I was fucking busy, and I didn't have time to plan. Are you going to be okay around all the booze and the coke and shit, because I can just make sure no one does it. I'll be fine. Yeah? Thanks, man. Yeah. I'm rebalancing away from crypto into eco. Sounds, uh, <laughs> futuristico. Yeah, it's good. It's, good. <laughs> it's better than being carried around in dad's pockets like fucking Stuart Little. They're nice pockets. Spacious. <laughs> How is he? He's, I mean, you know. Actually, How did they patch uh, things up so quickly? He's got me overseeing the satellite launch out of Tanagashima. Bob Galpin is I mean, he just understands and, uh, why? that his dad is which is nice. like that. Good for you, bro. Yeah. I guess I finally broke out of the cage. You can't keep a good dog down, right, Ken? <laughs> I bet this is dope. <laughs> yeah. Hey, wait! Hey, is this, is, is this actually where I'm going to have my bachelor party? Why is this so wet? <laughs> There's a big leak somewhere. Ken, long time. Are we good? You're my third oldest friend. You fucked me like a tied goat. We're great. No, yeah, you're going the right way. Keep going straight. Okay, this is it. Yeah? Cool, right? Is it cool or is it like total fucking bullshit? Who knows? Well, what is it? What is it? It's a physical fun palace. It's basically, <laughs> if you're into it and she's into it, it's all good. Oh my god, look at this fucking guy with the bird mask, like it's eyes wide shut. Oh wow. <laughs> eyes 
Wait, is this is this gonna be an orgy? No. <laughs> what do you see? Angela. She says like a radar for it. Angela. Angela. Yo. Dust. Oh. Hey. Hi. Oh. So. Yeah. Hey. What's yeah. happening? Who is this again? Here we are. From yeah, Dust. In, uh, From the. In Sunset Park. Whatever. Yeah. The startup that he was just at. I feel like this is synchronicity. Oh. Yeah, like the universe is telling us something. Yeah. yeah. We really appreciated you coming to see us. Yeah. Yeah. Totally. I, I'm super excited. Yeah. Totally. Me too. All right, see, see you. Yeah. <laughs> Didn't get that deal. Mm -mm. No. You know, I was thinking maybe one wine, one water is like an informal rule for the group. Also, uh, they have risotto balls. You know, like they're so soakers, super soakers. Ketamine. Greg, Greg, got you one. Ask them where they were on 9-11. What? If they don't know, they could be under 21. Well, Shiv gave me a hall pass. Uh. They're adults. <laughs> Okay. Okay. <laughs> Multiple times. Um, wow. So. Yeah, yeah. And what Shiv has that like that same arrangement? She's an adult too, so. Hmm. What? No, no. Well, One way. Yeah, sure. I mean, I don't know, Greg. It's like, not a competition. No, no. I'm, that's that's cool. I'm sure you guys have it all figured out. Yeah. I love you, man. But you know, I had to follow the money. You know that, right? I get it. All right. Hey, why don't we talk in private for a second? Can we do that? We can talk right here. All right. How would you like to be all the way out? Half a bill for your share of Waystar. Is this for real? Yeah, man. Why would you want to be even more in? I mean, the place is a fucking antique Can shop. Just take the money and get out, please. Hmm. 500, though? That's I mean, lot of oh, bill. 500 no. mil. Yeah, no. It's uh, not uninteresting. Fantastic. Great. So listen, there's a part two to this. Why don't we talk this over with Sandy? Sandy Furness? Come with me. Come. He's better. Sandy's the opposition, right? I don't see these. Uh-huh. Um, What's your table in <laughs> in philosophy? Uh, no, he's my on, philosophy is I literally station. don't give a fuck, so. So what's that need Your wedding planning together? These are what, it's on our registry. We're just hanging out. Oh. You should go for these. Wait, registry. Oh, her registry. Right, you want They're to both getting married. Oh, that's right. Mm -hmm. Sandy comes to these? Yeah, oh, yeah. No, he loves sex. <laughs> Dude. The thing that he pees through, he puts into other people. It's fucking vile and a lot. What? Hey, Sandy. What? <laughs> oh, gents, excuse me. He wants your piece of pie, mm. but, and please don't fucking blow a fuse here, okay? The reality is, he's already in on Waystar. As in? As in, Sandy's me, and I'm Sandy. That's right. We're like a single entity. That's right. Like a creature from mythology. That's right. You're ready, let him in. of a horse, dick of a swan. I'm a parasite Jeez. on a parasite. You should have disclosed that to me when I brought you in. You are 100% correct about that. I should have done that. You were in a yeah. tough position. I mean, this would be a really cool way to stick so it to them now. Getting into tech. Does that? Yeah. yeah, I have a fund. But you know, we're, we're niche, but we're engaged. Just closed a deal tonight, actually. And no, uh, you didn't. I found these four Stanford grads who are doing this thing. <coughs> it's oh, it's pretty cool. They do. have this uh, cluster of hydrogen lamps. Yeah. Wait, be around. Going? Dude, are you pitching? Did you just pitch? To him. The enemy. <laughs> hey, Rome, the adults are talking. How about you go play in the other room? Hey, Sandy, could I maybe get a moment with you in private? I'd like to talk to you about how attached you're feeling to your 50 failing local TV stations. You're embarrassing yourself. Your family. He used to lock me in a cage. What the fuck? No, that's a that's a true story. Oh, wait, you're, you're pretending that you don't remember the dog pound. Are you tripping? Yeah, it was a game. I had to go climb in this big dog cage in the kitchen and wait for someone to come collect me. Oh, yeah. Jeez. No. What was that bullshit? Uh, what? Oh, I what can't. Fuck well, I can doing? say what I want. Yeah, but you, I mean, that was insane. You're acting insane. Well, so you just want me to pretend that none of that happened? What happened? None of it happened. Dog pound didn't happen. I never made you eat dog food. There was a bowl that was filled with chow, and I couldn't leave the cage until I finished. It was a game. It was a game. You enjoyed it. I mean, I, I enjoyed asked Connor. It. Yeah, ask Connor. I enjoyed, I shipped. Being, I enjoyed shipped. being in a cage with a leash around oh, my neck oh, so for now three there's fucking a leash? hours. Yeah, there was a leash. Of the, I'm full. Oh, oh freak it. Me? I'm full of shit. Have fun. Get the fuck out of here. Oh, <laughs> asshole. Damn. I wonder how much they're all holding in. Yeah, I know. 
from their entire lives. It was just like how messed up their relationship are with each other. Sure, I remember a game he used to play. What? Okay, so he did. He used to lock me in a fucking cage. Sure, the big cage, yeah, in your mother's place. The laundry room in Cheltenham. Cheltenham, thank you. He's trying to gaslight me. No, you liked it. You asked to be put in that cage. What? Yeah, it okay. was really weird, but I think you enjoyed it. <laughs> Tom! Hey. Hey, have you seen Kendall? No. This guy wants to have sex so bad. I don't know. I feel like we should maybe keep an Let's eye on... use this hall pass. Well, I just wanted just to be clear in terms of you and me. Is this like a, is this a quid pro quo arrangement? I don't know what you're talking about. Oh, it's yes. just you know if I if I for instance you know if I if I touch a boob do you do you grab a dick? <laughs> I, I don't know if just that's to get a rough a... turn of comparison like from Fahrenheit to Celsius or you know an eye for an eye or oh. orifice for an orifice. I mean, I'm just trying to get a sense of the parameters here. Uh, Tom, I can't negotiate right now. But we know, right? We just, you know. Sure. Well, I heard from the girls. The dust thing with the art. Yeah, I, I, I know. I saw them. It's locked down. Oh, well, they wanted... They, they wanted you to know they loved you in the room. Frank. But Frank. I just spoke to the girl. We're good. Ken, they're already setting this up elsewhere. But, but like I said, they loved you in the what room. What are you talking about? I, I think there's other money and they like it better. He wants it that bad. I just need to win. <laughs> mm. Or maybe he does believe that he can monetize it really well. I mean, I'm sure someone else would gladly take his money. Or is it also because of his reputation? Maybe, yeah. And he needs... His family? Mm hmm I mean, whatever it is you need, I can make it happen. Okay? Yeah, okay. Okay? So, are we good? You know, it's just not about that. Uh, then, like, help me out here. Because there's something I'm not seeing. It's the name. Which? You mean Dust? <laughs> Roy. Roy. Hmm. Kendall Roy. It'd be like I was marrying Hitler and then I'd get to be what? Mrs. Hitler? Okay, uh, that's not really fair. I mean... I'm sorry. It's cool. We just don't want to be Hitler. Can you stop saying fucking Hitler, please? <laughs> like, you don't know what I Consensus says you're a coked up prick who can't shit straight. Okay, look. Hey, listen. Fuck off! Yeah, you can't do that. So maybe this is kind of a motivator for him now to be all the way out. True. He hey, doesn't man, want to be associated with his dad. No! Just ask me. Do you have to pay your share now? Like, how does that work? <laughs> I, I imagine that's expensive. Firstly, Senator, welcome. Your wife very tragically took her own life oh, 18 shoot. months ago. Jeez. Or Mr. Etienne, welcome. Oh, I think everybody I know. knows about that. Tonight but it hasn't been is... long, and I guess that what some people may ask is what could possibly have caused such a tragedy. And wow. Oh, wow. Oh. Suddenly, to turn around and run for the highest office. Doesn't he have a line for this? That's usually normally I'm okay. Focused. You Hello? know, why don't we stop playing this game of pretend sympathy where you're just trying to get your viewers to ask what sort of guy has a wife who kills herself? That is You want to make this good. personal? Let's talk about Logan Roy, shall we? Look at his relationships with his oh, family. There, there it is. is. Only there it is. Has come to work for me. What does oh, that tell oh, you? Oh. There you go. I'm not the fucking angle. Whoa, whoa. That's a chunk of chain you got there, buddy. It sure okay. is, Greg. Mm -hmm. Can I help you with something, man? What, what, what the fuck's going on? You, you've been up my ass all night. No, I know. I, just, just keeping an eye out for you. I mean, drugs. You, you don't know is where. This, they... Is this Rava? Did she put you up to this? I'm about to do these four lines of cocaine to top up the four I just did. Oh. Snap. And then my heart's gonna explode. So, if you want to stop me, be my guest. I don't do white drugs. My dad's gonna be super disappointed if his son ODs. I know. So. Okay, 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 stop, stop. Okay, I'll give it to me. Why does he have to do it? Just knock it off the table or He's something. Just being an ass. I'm going. Ooh, Greg. Oh, go for it, Greg. Suck on those big white dicks, you fucking <laughs> pervert. <laughs> <laughs> Oh no, Greg. Is Greg gonna <laughs> die? No. Oh. 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 I need to. Should I puke? 
Not unless oh. you can keep up your entire bloodstream. <laughs> so you saw the interview? They told me. You came after the man's wife. They said. Are you okay with that? <laughs> Tell him not to speak about my family, not on my network, not on any network ever again, or I'll end them. Oh, yeah, silence the man who says you're stifling this ad. <laughs> I'm a bad father. How dare he? He's a bad fucking husband. He killed his wife. Oh, come on, Dad. I want to talk about you properly. Come in. I'm mm. tired of this. You have potential. I've always thought you were the smartest. Oh, so that's why you tried Kendall and Roman first. <laughs> if this is the way things are going to go, then fuck off, Dad. Then I'm truly sorry. Jeez. Hey, fuck you. I'm not like your little pet that you get to kick around. Oh, oh, I'm sorry. Excuse me, spacesuit. Bruh. You think that I can't make your life difficult, but word in the right ear, and I could be your migraine, motherfucker. I came here to talk to the old man on your word, so make it happen. Oh my god, dude! That was insane! Oh, yeah? Yeah. Me and this girl, we go into the side room, and we start making out, and then I'm touching her, and then she goes down on me. And then I splooge in her mouth, you know, and get, I know, I know, and get this. She kisses me and puts it back in my mouth, and I swallow. Uh. Which, the cum? <laughs> I know, so hot. You swallowed your own load? Yeah, I heard of it, but I don't, I, I didn't know it actually happened. Well, I haven't heard about it before. I know, <laughs> it's a thing, there's a word for it. And I can't remember what it is right now. <laughs> so fucking hot. Is he still talking about that? Yeah. It's pathetic. Yeah, yeah. He enjoyed it, right? Oh, yeah. I mean, you did too. <laughs> you know, just messing around. Yeah, just messing around. Dad's theory was you got two fighting dogs, you send the weak one away, you punish the weak one, then everyone knows the hierarchy, then everyone's happy. So, away he went. Your dad was wow. responsible for that? Okay. Hi. Keep your money, bring me in. We do this properly. We go fuck my dad together. Hmm. Uh, Take over. Leverage buyout, hostile. Uh, that's a dual stock situation. That's that's not gonna be straightforward. Price in the toilet. Shareholders are pissed. You and me could force him to the table. Interesting. We take it apart. Fuck local TV, newspapers, parks. We bulldoze the whole fucking shanty town. We just keep the juiciest morsels. Turn the thing from a pot of rotting whales into one bastard great white. Morsels. I feel like anything he's like a hundred percent sure on, when it really comes down to it, <laughs> he gets hesitant. He's not hesitant, but I think he acts emotionally. Yeah. And he doesn't think mm -hmm. about all the outcomes. Listen, we've been advised, and we are really sorry, but I don't think it's a good idea for him to come to the wedding. Oh, yeah, that sounds sensible. Shiv. He really is sorry. You can even tell her. <laughs> yeah, so. Okay. Bye. Mm -hmm. This is petty okay. AF. Yeah, great. It's two last wedding dinners for the caterers to have to organize. And I would be your point man on this, so you would not have to <laughs> this is just like my dad. So, lip service. if we could find a price. Mm -hmm. But there's potential. It could happen. Yes. Let's jerk him around for a bit, then throw him back. <laughs> this fucking family. <laughs> Oops, wait, that's funny. Everyone that deals with them is like, How's it going? Mm -hmm. Greg tells me you swallowed your own load. <laughs> yeah, it was... Yeah, it's pretty wild. <laughs> it's cool though, because it's like I didn't cheat. Because oh. all the sperm stayed in my own body. Like a oh. closed loop system. So. Is that how it's defined? It'd be really nice to see ship. Willa! So. What happened? <laughs> <laughs> you know, just. Like this and that. Usual. Normal stuff. Specifically what, Tom? I thought she said it was. Probably just playing with him. Wait, what? No. 
Chevy. I thought you said. Oh, mm. honey, I'm <laughs> <laughs> Oh, it's good to do that. <laughs> He's in a suit. Yeah, Frank. Those girls from the art thing, I want you to put the word around. They're junkies. Wow. They're sluts. They're shooting seed capital straight into their arms. Let's sink them. Wow. It's the come up of the new Kendall. I don't know if there's anything new. Well, he's taking a different angle. Gentlemen, shall we? Like, it's not just about screwing over his dad, it's like, now whoever comes in my way, is gonna get it. <coughs> Alright. Cool. Yeah, like interesting. Them. Very interesting. Yeah. I didn't see that, that coming, in terms of where they were gonna go with the story and how they're gonna keep it going, but him going to a major competitor and then them going head to head mm -hmm. that could last for such a long time yeah yeah um but i after <laughs> after being after revealing what what stewie had going on your immediate action is to go into business with him it's like i don't know he doesn't he still is the same guy he he's not making good decisions who, Kendall? Kendall, yeah. Like, yeah. he's well, now... I, well, you're right. It is an emotional decision. It's about getting back at his dad. Like, now I feel like he's... It's even worse. What do you mean even worse? Like, you're blinded by by rage oh, and... yeah. And... Yeah. A hundred percent. Yeah. Like, even what you said <laughs> about, like, those girls. Like, that's yeah. just him being petty. Which... He's just butthurt. Which is interesting, because maybe... He actually starts turning a little bit more into his dad. Yeah, actually, I, like, I like, feel like that's what is happening. And he actually becomes like a formidable foe, but he has to become such a ter terrible person mm -hmm. to do it. Yeah, which is what his dad wanted him to be if he was going to take over from his CEO. Because mm -hmm. he was saying, like, why are you going to be so effing weak? <laughs> and now he's like, all right, let's do this. <sighs> oh, man. Kendall, I just... It's only been, like, what, seven, eight episodes, but already I can't trust anything that Kendall <laughs> does <laughs> in terms of, like, having confidence in any of his plans. Oh, I see. It's like, it's gonna, he's yeah. like the tragic hero. Yeah. Like, well, it's, that's it's what gonna, makes it interesting to see, like, how it's gonna play out. <laughs> or not. See how, how he's gonna feel, like, how bad will it be this time. But, I don't or know. Or not. <laughs> yeah, I mean, definitely lots of ways that it could go. He could take him down, he could bring him to a certain point and then kind of screw them. I don't know, they're, 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 that's I don't know. a lot of fun things there. I could see in all this, like, him being blindsided and him getting screwed over oh, yeah. by... Easy. So, like, he's just, yeah, like, that blinded by rage. And it could start right there in that contract, something that yeah. he'll overlook. Yeah. Right? Just because he wants to get it done. Yeah. Which he's done before. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> um, okay, so the other main thing here was... Um, not necessarily Tom and what he did. Oh but... my gosh, I was to say Tom. Can we talk about, like, when there's not much else to say about Tom, but... Oh my gosh, Tom. Yeah, man. You're just so determined to He's have something happen. He's just so that... cringe. <laughs> He's so... Cr oh, so is Connor, too. Connor, this... like, just creeps me out so much. It's like, I mean, like that's why Tom, Tom makes sense for this family. Like, he's, he fits in. Oh, gosh. <laughs> uh, Shiv... Um, yeah. lots going on with her. Yeah. Um, obviously, the cheating has been going on for mm. a while now. It's pretty obvious how she's being used in this campaign. And now, the, like, it was already pretty bad, but it's even worse now with her and her dad. Mm hmm To the point where he's not coming to the wedding. Yeah. And she's obviously impacted by it. Yeah. Even though she does not enjoy him right yeah. now. It's still her dad. <sighs> so. Yeah, that sucks. Yeah. And he couldn't even tell her himself. See, I don't know how much of that is him. How much of this is, like, I think it's part him. of Marsha's game. Like, I don't oh, know. Oh, like, to break up the family, kind of, maybe? Yeah. Because, like, even the look that he had, like, sure, it was, like, sh shame. Like, he he didn't want to say it himself, but... I don't know. Like, I, like, I've Marcia seen Marsha, like, like, talk him into things, too. Yeah. So, like, I don't know. 
like him updating her and her just being like, oh, you probably shouldn't go to the wedding. Yeah, to really exactly. make her feel it. So. Maybe. Because there is something about <coughs> him where, like, he, I don't know, like, his concern for Kendall. For Kendall like, I was like, well, so he, like, it really. It feels genuine. Like, yeah, it feels genuine, even though we, that whole dog thing in the childhood, that's what really effed up if that's how it yeah. went down. But, but see, like, there's layers to it now because of the last episode of, like, what did he go through and what did he experience that he he, he isolated from his family mm. so someone in the comments um last week mentioned that do you remember they said that they didn't think that he could swim they're like oh get your dad out there in the pool and they're like oh no he doesn't swim mm. um one, one person mentioned that like the, the reason that his kids don't think that he can swim is because he never wanted them to know because he never wanted to take off his shirt in front of them he never wanted okay. them to see the like the lashes on his back um. and to fully understand what he had to go through to get them to where they are. Mm-hmm. So there's like, there's so much trauma on his end that forced him, not not to justify any of the things that he did to his kids, but it's like, it's not just oh, him yeah. being an I ass. I forgot about those. Yeah. So it's like, like... There's some layer of protection there. That's why he has to be like that. I guess. There, there's that, and then there's also like... Yeah, there's, there's trauma that he dealt with that caused him to yeah. to make Man, some of I just decisions. wasn't very convinced by those scratches. They looked <laughs> fresh. They did not look like scars. Yeah, no, it, it didn't. Like, I agree, but... it didn't. But, like, it makes so much sense in, in the story. Hmm. That they're, like, just older scars that have healed over. Oh, my gosh. If I end up liking <laughs> well, that, <laughs> this guy yeah, down the road... That would be an accomplishment yes, by this story. Yes, that would be incredible. Like, the, the writers? Yeah. So, I don't know. Yeah. I think that's, that's tough. <laughs> that would be... Yeah, that would be incredible. Nice. Okay. Um, anything else you want to say about this episode? Mm, no. <laughs> I mean, in a way, I kind of feel sorry for Tom, even though he's super cringy. It's like that's what his that was his bachelor party. You know what I mean? Like, but I mean, he got to do. He had a good time. Yeah, I know, but it wasn't what like it wasn't really for him. Obviously, oh, no, everyone. Not at all. Yeah. But I whatever. Mean, he was excited about it. When he got in, he was like, oh, yeah. this, is, this is looking good. Yeah. <laughs> got to use his hall pass. Oh, Greg is probably going to be able to move. Because Kendall made it out alive. True. Yeah, he just has to broach that topic with Logan again. Yeah. Imagine Logan's like, I don't remember saying <laughs> that. <laughs> oh, man. Interesting. Cool. Yeah. All right. Well, it's getting. we're getting close to the end of the season. I think there's two more episodes left. Okay. So, see how they, they end this one mm-hmm. and set it up for probably a lot more drama so um hopefully you enjoyed that one uh we definitely did i think that was one of the better ones for me uh we'll see you in the next one peace bye